Mtazamaji seneta wa Kakamega Cleophas Malala ameachiliwa huru kutoka korokoro za polisi bila masharti baada ya mkurugenzi wa mashtaka ya umma kufutilia mbali mashtaka dhidi yake. Malala aliyekamatwa jana amesema hatokubali kuhujumiwa wala kushurutishwa kidai kuwa alikamatwa kwa sababu ya mfumo mpya wa ugavi wa mapato. Haya yanajiri huku mwenzake wa Samburu seneta Steve Lelengwe akihojiwa kwa siku ya pili katika kituo cha polisi cha Maralal kutokana na visa vya wizi wa mifugo katika kaunti ya Samburu. Seneta wa kaunti ya Kakamega Cleophas Malala leo aliondoka kituo cha polisi cha Mumi Asakiwa Huru baada kukesha korokoroni kufuatia kukamatwa kwake na maafisa wa idara ya upelelezi wa jinai kwa madai ya kukiuka kanuni za kudhibiti ugonjwa wa COVID-19 huko Mumias. Malala ambaye alikamatwa Jumatatu jijini Nairobi alisafirishwa kwa gari hadi Mumias na maafisa wa idara ya upelelezi wa jinai akidaiwa kuwa halihitajika kuandikisha taarifa kwa kosa hilo. Hata hivyo alikesha usiku kucha katika kituo hicho cha polisi bila kuandikisha taarifa yoyote na leo akaachiliwa huru bila masharti bila kushtakiwa kwa chochote. Director of Public Prosecution has directed that uh, there is no reason as to why the senator should continue being held and I believe as a lawyer I can state affirmatively the decision by the Director of Public uh, prosecution is informed by the fact that there can be no valid charge in the manner in which it was intended by the police akihutubia wanahabari baada ya kuachiliwa huru malala alidai kuwa halikamatwa kwa sababu ya mfumo mpya wa ugavi wa mapato huku akisema hata kubali kuhujumiwa wala kushurutishwa kuunga mkono mfumo huo ambao utaadhiri vibaya maeneo mengine ya nchi need to have a win win formula in this uh, conversation we shall not accept and i will not be part of a leadership that makes a decision to take away money from less fortunate counties like turkana like marsabit like tana river and take them to mount kenya i will not accept that wakili wake aliyepia rais wa chama cha wanasheria hapa nchini nelson avi ametaja kukamatwa kwa malala na maseneta wenzake wawili kwa kitendo kilichochochewa kisiasa of course there is malice and if there was no malice nothing would have been easier than to arraign uh, Senator Malala in a court of law today because I came here to go and take plea and the fact that there is no plea to be taken here means uh, the charge uh, was not there in the first place it can only have been malicious Haya najiri huku mwenzake Senator wa Samburu Steve Lelegwe akijisalimisha kwa siku ya pili katika kituo cha polisi cha Maralal ili kuhojiwa na maafisa wa idara ya upelelezi wa jinai kutokana na visa vya uwezo wa mifugo katika kaunti ya Samburu Nime record statement yangu na nimesema haya yote ambayo wanasema mimi sijui. Hawajasema watanipeleka mahakamani na nimeashiliwa, nimeambiwa ni nimemaliza kuandika statement. Wakinihitaji wataniita tena. Senator Lelegwe amesema atadumisha msimamo wake katika kuhakikisha kuwa kaunti hiyo haitapoteza pesa kupitia mfumo mpya uliopendekezwa kwa ugavi wa mapato miongoni mwa serikali za kaunti wakati wa hatamu yake kama seneta wa kaunti hiyo. Kamila hiyo ikipitishwa nafikiri sisi kama wasamburu tutaumia zaidi kwa sababu bado tuligandamiswa tuli na ye ile marginalization ambaye ilikuwa tangu hapo mbeleni. Na sisi kama wasamburu leo tumejua nani ambaye amesimama na sisi na nani ambaye anataka ku, kuhakikisha kwamba wasamburu watarudi nyuma. Mwanzake seneta wa Bomet Christopher Lagat aliachiliwa huru kwa dhamana bila malipo. Aliachiliwa huru jana baada ya kukanusha mashtaka ya uchochezi. Kiongozi wa chama cha ODM Raila Odinga kwenye ukurasa wake wa Twitter amesema matukio kukamatwa kwa maseneta hao ni ukumbusho kuwa vita vya kupigania demokrasia hapa nchini vingali vikiendelea. Ben Chumba, Darubini ya Channel 1.